Hi, this is Mark from LongIslandWatch.com, and today I'm going to be some, doing something I haven't done in a while. I'm going to be showing you a new Squale watch. Um, whoops, let me grab it. Oi! Kind of stoked about it. I did see it in Basel. Um, it was, I think it was in one of my wrap-up videos. It's the uh, Onda, uh, with the blue, Onda, which is Wave in Italian, with the blue dial. That's a 1520. <laughs> I'll keep that in there because that was pretty funny. That was my phone that just went down. Uh, it's a 1521 with a blue dial. Uh, as you guys know, I'm a big fan of the brand. I have the blue dial, regular blue on the bracelet. I wear it often. Uh, just in case you didn't know, I have been running the SqualeWatches.com store for, I think it's over three years now. And just recently, I was permitted to onboard the brand back to LongIslandWatch.com. Uh, so you'll see them, you know, being sold at both sites, but it's still me. I'm the same guy. Nothing changed. I'm still the uh, USA Online uh, point of sale. What am I wearing today? I uh, don't know if you saw the video yet. I don't know what order these are going to be published in, but I've got the Sarb 033 on the Jubilee bracelet, uh, Angus Jubilee. Uh, it looks awesome. And then, of course, for the occasion, I'm wearing the 1521 uh, limited edition Lion Shark. Uh, these were 100 pieces that were made last year uh, for another YouTuber, uh, the Urban Gentry TGV. I uh, sold out of 100 pieces in something like 40 days or so. Um, so when I saw they were getting down to single digits, I snatched one up for myself. Anyway, let's head on over and uh, check out the wave. So I have for you here the 1521 Onda watch. Onda, again, is... Uh, wave in italian this is the blue dial version i do believe there was another dial version but i do not think we're going to get it um this is the blue dial version and if you're familiar with the squale lineup uh it is in the classic the 1521 or 50 atmos case it's a 500 meter water resistant watch it's probably one of the most comfortable watch cases i've ever worn uh, even at 41 or 42 millimeter, it, it wears it wears much smaller. People with tiny wrists wear this watch with um, without much of a problem at all. So it's like I said, it's based on it. Basically, is a 50 atmos with just a different dial uh, and a bezel insert. The watch will retail for right around in the high 900s, right around a thousand bucks. Uh, it is powered by an Eta movement. Let's uh, let's get into the detail. So it's powered by the Eta. 2824, which is a 25 joule uh, movement at hand wind and hack. So probably the only complaint I could ever give you about this watch is that the crowns are difficult to unscrew uh, because they're tucked away so nicely. Um, but once you unscrew the crown and you pull it out to set the time, the second hand will stop. You can see that. And you can pull it out one click to set the date. As I said, the watch hand winds. So in the out position, you just wind it. Uh, and obviously it winds by you wearing it on your wrist. The power reserve is a full 40 hours, so you can wear it all day, take it off at night, and put it on, a, you know, the day after the following day, and it should still be running. So it is 42 millimeters in diameter. That's bezel diameter. The case itself, as you can see, this what they call a Von Boring case, that's the founder of Squally Watches, uh, is actually 41 millimeters. The bezel sticks out just a tiny bit. Uh, it's 14 millimeters thick. It is going to be 48 on the tip to tip. You see the lugs curve down nicely. And it is a 20 millimeter lug. Uh, it does have, uh, it will fit the optional Squale mesh bracelet, any of the Squale tan, brown, black, or uh, black straps, or any other 20 millimeter nylon strap, leather strap, rubber strap that you want to put on it. But it does come on this awesome, you know, real, you know, vanilla scented uh, rubber strap with the wave pattern on it. Uh, one thing that I do not like lately is that sometimes they do not have signed buckles all the time. And that's just, <laughs> that really bothers me because I, you know, it's signed on the back. I believe the logo, the company name is right there, but I do enjoy when they have the, the older engraved buckles. So it is a solid screw down case back as it is a 500 meter water resistant watch. Uh, Squale uh, means shark in the dialect, uh, northern Italian dialect. Uh, 500 meters, 50 atmos professional. 
sapphire crystal stainless steel case solid screw down back i might have just said that so the highlight of this watch for me of course is the dial um and actually the bezel the bezel insert kind of makes it look you know, a little bit like a yacht master if you will you know like the, the platinum bezel yacht master let's zoom in and check out the dial so there you can see the dial come to life and now you know where the watch gets its name from onda meaning wave it's swiss made at the bottom 50 atmos onda and the squale logo at the top a lot of people sometimes complain that Squally double logoed the dials. They did not do that here. Um, beautiful markers, mirror, you know, mirror finish markers with loom. Nice hands, beautifully done. The way they do the chapter ring, just making it you know, a polished piece uh, on their matte 1521 blues and, and blacks. They, they make the, the chapter ring matte as well or blasted. It's a great job. And look, check out the bezel from the side. Easy to turn, easy to grip and it is a 120 click unidirectional ratcheting bezel. Nice insert, you know, it's kind of, like I said, almost looks platinum. It's not, it's, it's a regular insert, but it's, uh, it's raised relief, just really, really nicely done. And let's just take a minute to appreciate the case finishing. Look at the case design. Say this isn't round, it's actually angular, just a little bit, nice polishing. They really do you know, an awesome job. Let's, let's see what she's going to look like uh, on your night dives. It is very sunny today, but here that's the best I can pretty much do. Easy to read. Uh, you can see what they did with the super loom on the hands and the markers and the uh, registration dot on the rotating bezel. It looks great. It's easy to read. You know, they, they don't use cheap loom. They use super loom. So it does an, it does an amazing job. So I will put this on my wrist. Uh, we'll take a look, see how it looks on my six and three quarter inch wrist. I know it's going to look awesome because I'm already, I'm wearing uh, one of the 1521 cases already and I have another blue dial that, you know, I wear the heck out of and absolutely love it. But let's see how that dial pattern comes out. So here it is on my six and three quarter inch wrist. And like I said, it fits like a dream. Very comfortable, beautiful, love the way it looks. And because it's a, you know, it's a dive strap, so I'm almost at the last hole, so maybe this will go down to like a six and a half inch wrist, but look at how much larger it will accommodate. You know, if you, if you have a smaller wrist, you may have to pick up uh, a smaller strap. They do make a tropical rubber strap that is 115 by 75, so it's a good deal shorter than this one. Um, but this is great on a, a blue nylon strap or a brown leather. Uh, there's really, you know, endless possibilities, you know, to, to play with the blue dial. I am not sure if I mentioned it, the, crystal is coated with AR on the inside. So when you look at it without the reflection of the you know, direct light, the crystal does basically just disappear. Anyway, this has been Mark from LongIslandWatch.com showing you the new Squale 1521 owned a model. Please like this video if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe to the channel if you have not done so. If you have any questions or comments, put them down below and I will be sure to address them as soon as I can. Thank you very much for watching. Bye-bye.